Wow, they have a 102,000 BTU iron gas grill at Costco. It's actually a KitchenAid iron gas grill that they call a nine burner iron gas grill with cover. Costs two thousand two hundred ninety nine dollars. Roughly, these things cost around three thousand bucks or so. Um, it's gonna be kind of hard to find on the internet, so I'll leave some links below. But basically, this is the KitchenAid eight burner outdoor island gas grill with rotisserie burner. So that's why they say it's a nine um, a nine burner grill. But overall, if you can see it, it's a pretty big island, which is pretty nice. It has fake wood. No, I'm sorry, fake stone work on the sides, um, and this looks really stunning with a lot of stainless steel and probably very easy to clean up as you can see there's there's nine burners but or nine knobs but one tiny one for the rotisserie one the two sides actually have additional counter space that fold up that you can actually remove as well there is light switches for it as well and of course the fake um stone is pretty much all around it the burners are supposed to burn evenly throughout the entire range which is they have this even burn technology and they have a rotisserie burner at the back of the of the grill as well. Closing this whole thing up, basically this stainless steel is absolutely beautiful and there's a heavy top, which is really nice. On top of the top, there's a the thermostat, which is goes up to 800 degrees. Of course, it realigns at 600. And of course they have a secondary cooking area, which adds which adds two extra burners that are 1200, 12,000 BTU burners each. And basically a side searing, one side searing burner that's 15,000 BTU. Um, of heat. So two 12,000 and one 15,000 searer, which is pretty darn awesome. Another thing is that the lid actually closes down for more additional workspace, but overall total cooking space, you have over a thousand 193 square inches. But with that lid closed down, you have a lot of working space. There are two shelves underneath the searing burning area for the secondary cooking area, which is pretty awesome. And the controls are extremely simple, you know, basically ignition on high um the storage below is pretty nice it basically has a crossbar in the shelving which i don't understand why because they were made of metal so it seems pretty stiff already but overall the stainless steel is good they actually have a battery button for ignition which is really nice as well um other fun stuff is more storage inside uh, more for where the pro propane goes uh the liquid filled propane there is a liquid propane to natural gas converter, which is pretty cool for the system. And of course you can see those tiny little batteries right there. They're actually the ignition batteries as well. And there's a you know, battery box that's supposed to go over it and there's the ignition button. So pretty interesting stuff. Um, I guess because it's the demo, the battery box actually broke off or something, but well, there you have it, you can see it at least. And of course the propane um, you know, carriers over there as well, which you could go probably open from the back as well, I'm guessing. Other fun tools that they attach and chain on, which is pretty nice. Um, and on the other side, there's that other side of that extra counter space you guys should take off. It's actually another foot and a half. Um, but anyways, the KitchenAid 8 burner outdoor island gas grill with rotisserie burner. Pretty awesome stuff. Total of 102,000 BTU and 1,193 inches square inches of cooking space, which is awesome. Perfect for a large backyard barbecue for cooking a lot. Anyways, guys, please like, subscribe, and hit that bell button for more notifications for more Costco finds or other reviews and all the fun stuff from this channel. See you next time. Stay tuned. Bye.